Welcome back. My name is Ashley Osier. I'm the posture specialist and today I am talking about a posture challenge. I'm comparing the back joy with the tennis ball. They're going head to head and we are going to see which one is going to be the best to help you maintain good posture and we're doing that right now. If you are interested in improving your posture, decreasing pain, and enhancing your overall wellness, make sure to subscribe and click on the bell so that you don't miss anything. I did a video on the back joy last year, and I'll stream that link up, up top here. And I just wanted to see if there wasn't something else that I could utilize that would do something similar that might be a little more simple and still get you the results that you're looking for. So here's the back joy. It's supposed to sit up against the seat. And what it does is it rotates the hips so that we're not slumped. So when I did my review, I found that Though it does rotate the hips forward, which is fantastic, that's awesome, it doesn't necessarily do anything about the collapsing diaphragm here. You see, I can still just kind of rest back in my seat and slump. So, out comes the tennis ball. Uh, I have been using the tennis ball for posture work for over 20 years and it's very, very exciting. But before I show you this, I wanna give you some tennis ball facts. Did you know that the yellow tennis ball was first used at Wimbledon in 1986? Or that it was first introduced in 1972 because research demonstrated that this yellow was more visible on TV. Pretty interesting, huh? So two facts I'm going to give to you at the end of this video, so you'll wanna stick around to the end, but do you know who the fastest server is in women's tennis? Or do you know what they call this yellow? I will tell you both at the end of this video, so make sure you stick around to the end. Do you have any experience using the tennis ball? If you do, I want to hear your comments down below. How do you use the tennis ball for your wellness? Okay, so here we go. We have the tennis ball. All you need to do is take your bottom, put it straight back to the chair. Your feet are going to be flat against the floor in line with your knees. Your knees should be in line with the front of your hips. You're gonna take the tennis ball and in line with your ribs here, you're gonna place it just outside of the spine so you're not gonna be on the spine itself. You're gonna be just outside on the ropey muscle band, okay, so in line with the ribs that come out right here. And you can go ahead and just press back in. That's it, and then watch. When I try and collapse, it makes it very difficult. Now I wanna say that the chair that I'm in right now, it does kind of lean me back a little bit. So I do feel some engagement of my core muscles, which is good because we always want to be engaging our core abdominal muscles. We wanna be zipped up, just as I've talked about in the Three Lock Mountain. And if you haven't seen that, you can check that out up here. So the Three Lock Mountain, we definitely want to be engaging that pelvic lock and zipping up. And then we have, of course, the diaphragm lock and then the throat lock. And I have another video. I'll either stream that here or I'll have it at the end in the playlist or a single video. But the tennis ball here in this point is absolutely perfect to help you to make sure that you don't collapse Having your bottom against the seat helps you to make sure that your hips are rotated so that you're nice and lengthened. You don't have to sit on a back joy. This is a $40 product. 
a tennis ball, you can get, what, three tennis balls for five bucks? Tops, maybe three bucks if you find uh, an inexpensive can. You can have one in your home, in your car, and at the office. I will tell you that it is a lot simpler to stay lengthened and not to collapse in the diaphragm when you have the tennis ball in your back. So use a tennis ball. I want to hear comments. Let me know what you think, how you like it. If you're using the back joy, I would love to hear your experience with it. How do you like it? What do you use it for? I would love for you to try the tennis ball and also try the back joy. And I want you to tell me, do they work the same? Are they both helpful? Are they different? How are they different? I really want to hear what you think and what your experience is. Did you guess who the server was in women's tennis that has the fastest serve? If you guessed Serena Williams, you were right. 127 miles per hour or 127.381 miles per hour to be exact. Pretty impressive. The color of the yellow tennis ball is called optic yellow. And those are your fun facts. Thanks for watching. I hope this has been helpful for you. Make sure to like and share with your friends. This is a fantastic gift. And also make sure to tell them about the posture tip. Check out my Instagram at the posture specialist. You can follow me there and see what I'm doing on that social media platform. Thank you for watching the video. Thank you for subscribing and supporting the channel. I look forward to our next video. And until then, happy posturing.